Hi, I'm Ima. I'm a grandma and a mom. And look what I have, a kite. This is my kite. It's not very big, but it can go really high into the air. And sometimes I like to take it out on a slightly windy day and watch it go flying around in the sky. Do you like kites? I hope you do because we have a very simple book today called The Kite. Have you ever flown a kite before? Have you ever seen one in the sky? Here's what it looks like when it's flying around in the sky. See it fly, fly, fly. Here are the words if you want to learn some of the words. See it fly, fly, fly. See it fly so high? Whoa, it's up there by the clouds. Here are the words. See it fly so high? And that's a question mark at the very end of that sentence. This is a sentence and there's a question mark and that question mark tells you that it's a question. So you say, see it fly so high? It's kind of like saying, do you see it fly so high? Huh, it means the same thing. See it fly so high, woo! And look, his, his hair is blowing in the wind. It's a little bit windy. It has to be a little bit windy for flying a kite. See it fly in the sky? Doesn't this kite look like it has a smiley face? See it fly in the sky? Oh, actually, I said this like a question, didn't I? I said, see it fly in the sky like a question. But there is no question mark at the end. There's a period. So I read it wrong. So you know what I should say? I should say, see it fly in the sky. Because that's not a question. See it fly in the sky. OK. Will it touch the trees? There's a question mark, so that's a question. Will it touch the trees? Let's see if it touches the trees. Oh, good. It didn't. Will it touch the birds? Will it touch the birds? See the birds flying? Will it touch the clouds? That is one big fluffy cloud. Will it touch the clouds? Will it touch the clouds? It's a question. Ooh, it's so high. See my kite. And he has his little friend with him, his little puppy dog. See it fly so high. See it fly so high. If I could ride on my kite, hmm, he's thinking, if I could ride on my kite, I could fly, fly, fly. 
Would that be so fun? Yes, it would, huh? I could fly, fly, fly. If I could ride on my kite. And there he is, riding on his kite. He's using his imagination, huh? The end. That is a story about the kite by Mary Packard, illustrated by Ben Ray Huang. It's a My First Reader book, so you can learn some of the words. And again, here's my kite. Isn't it great? The colors are so bright. I really like my kite. And you can hear it. It's not very lightweight. It's not very heavy. It's very light. And here's the tail. I have the, I have a paper clip on the tail, but usually I take the paper clip off. Paper, paper clip off, and then the tail flies in the sky. Kites do much better if they have a tail. Well, I hope you liked that book about the kite. And remember something. I love you. Mwah. Come back again, okay? Bye. Love you.